welcome back to my channel. Today I'm going to be doing my January BoxyCharm unboxing. I am super excited. My first BoxyCharm of this year and I'm not going to talk too much. I'll get right into the video but before that don't forget to hit that subscribe button if you haven't already and also hit that thumbs up button and don't forget to hit that notification bell so you can be the first one to be notified when I upload my video. Alright guys, let's get into the box. Alright, so first in the box is this right over here. This is the Pharmacy Daily Greens Oil-Free Gel Moisturizer with Morigen and Papaya. And let's open this bad boy up. And um, this is for AM and PM. Ooh, I love, I love the packaging. It's very very luxe we love that oh let me check actually the price of this so this retails for 38 bucks which is pretty reasonable for high-end moisturizers because they tend to cost from 40 to 50 to 60 dollars in that range so this is pretty like reasonable for high-end moisturizers also it looks like it is vegan and cruelty free which is amazing and it contains hyaluronic acid whoop whoop oh it smells really nice it's like minty So first impression wise, I actually really like how the moisturizer feels on my face. It's not too oily, it's not too, it's not too much for my oily skin and I actually really really like it. So, so far so good. Um, I have to keep using it to know if it's thebomb.com. Okay, but uh, for my first time use, I like it a lot. Okay, I'm legit gonna cover this pimple up like this pimple on my nose. It's bothering the heck out of me, y'all. Like, you don't understand. So next in the box is this right over here. This is from Dr. Brandt Skin Changing. And it's the Triple Peptide Eye Cream. And this is for wrinkles, dark circles, puffiness. And it's also for AM and PM. And this retails for 82 bucks. That is a lot of money. So let's actually try this bad boy out and put it to the test because it is 82 bucks, which is hella expensive. So let's go ahead and try it. Okay, that actually feels really good on my eyes. Sometimes eye creams can be very, very thick. But this one is really nice and it just, it was so weird when I put it on, it has this like really cooling kind of feel to it and it like just refreshed my under eyes and I'm actually really liking it. It looks pretty good for the first use. $82, it's, it's a lot, but um, I gotta keep trying to know if it's worth $82, okay? Because I know eye creams don't give you an instant results, like any kind of like like skincare stuff doesn't give you instant results so I gotta keep trying that and I'll let you know if it's worth the cash money honey okay I'll let y'all know but so far I really like it all right y'all there's a lot of skincare products here which I personally love because it makes me try out new skincare lines so the next thing in the box is this Bali balm sweet orange and coconut lip balm right over here in this cute little packaging and this little bad boy retails for $33 yo I thought that $17 lip balm for my last boxycharm was a lot but like this $33 okay let's see let's see how amazing this is okay because I mean $33 is a lot for like any kind of lip product like it doesn't matter what but like that is, that is very expensive. Oh, I really like the packaging. It's really pretty. So it looks like this super cute packaging um, gives you like Hawaii vibes. <laughs> cute, cute. Okay, I'm not gonna lie y'all. This feels amazing on the lips. Is it worth $33? I don't know yet, okay? I have to try it. I have to keep trying it. I love the smell. It's not too much, but it's like, it's there. And also, I love how it feels on my lips. I love things that tingles, tingle on my lips, and this like kind of like tingles. And I love that. It's like this peppermint kind of smell, and it feels like pepperminty, if that makes sense. And I actually like it a lot. You know, 
I fall in love with things that are way too expensive. Like, I need to stop. Okay, so next in the box is this right over here. It's the Ciate the Velvet Palette. It's this 12 eyeshadow palette. And this retails for $30. And let's open this bad boy up. All right, really pretty palette. I love the packaging, super cute. Let's look at the shadows. These are pretty. But they're like mostly shimmers. Actually, no, 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 there's some matte. They're like shimmery. All of them are like kind of shimmery. I gotta swatch them to know if they're all shimmery or not. But super pretty. I love the colors. I did kind of cheat and peeked into the BoxyCharm box. And I didn't look at the palette inside, but I saw the blush color. And then I chose my outfit today. You know? I'm sorry, but I did what I had to do, okay? Okay, I gotta sneeze. Okay, it literally just went away. I hate when that happens. Oh my god. I'm gonna be sad that I couldn't sneeze, but I had to sneeze. Oh yeah, okay, so there are matte shades. Never mind. These are matte. They look shimmery, but they're actually matte. The swatches are okay. Oh, I really like that color. That could be a really pretty highlight, this one. Okay, I'm gonna start talking and I'm gonna put this, all right, to the test to see how these eyeshadows work. All right, so I just got done using the eyeshadow and um, honestly, the mattes are actually pretty good. The colors that are in the palettes are just hit or miss. Um, I don't love it or I don't hate it. It's just a palette that honestly, like I wouldn't need in my collection because I know a lot of eyeshadow palettes that work better than this and have better pigmentation with the same color pattern and color scheme. So yeah, like I'm not a really big fan of the formula. It looks good, it doesn't look bad, but um, it didn't stand out to me, you know? And that's that. And so this is the last product in the box. This is the Persona Cosmetics Power Brush. This is the dual end brush. And as you can see, I did not apply any blush or highlight because this is supposed to do that. And this retails for $24, which is, I mean, it's pretty expensive. But I mean, it has, it is a dual end brush and it's to apply highlight and blush. So let's try this bad boy out. All right, so I just got done using the brush and I just put some setting spray on and um, I do like the highlight and way better than the blush because I really think this is for cream products. I don't mind this brush, um, it's okay. I'm not really into dual end brushes because like I hate, like I don't know how to store them. Like it's just like, I don't know. I just always put my brushes in like a little, um, like those canisters. So like, I don't know how to store these because like if I put it this way, it's touching the bottom and that bothers me. All right, so that completes all the products in the box for this month. Okay, now let me just calculate the total price of the box. The total price of my box this month is 207 which is insane. I don't know how BoxyCharm does it, but they do. But yeah, guys, uh, that completes my video for today. Um, hope you all enjoyed the video today. And thank you so much for watching. And if you came this far, you're freaking amazing.